All right, so I've been in the market for uh, a light bar for our boat, and I went online like most people do, and go on YouTube, went on YouTube, and um, wanted to find an affordable light bar. I didn't want to spend seventeen hundred dollars for you know some of these other brands. So I, on a whim, I went out and uh, did some research on this Aurora brand, and uh, they sell it on Amazon. It comes from T-Top Lights down in West Palm Beach. So I ordered this light bar yesterday, and it showed up today. So uh, I'm going to unbox it. Claims all the hardware is stainless. I'm not sure. I have a magnet. I'm going to check it before I install it. Um, see what the wiring harness looks like. So uh, I'm going to unbox this real fast and see what it's all about. Now they claim this is a 34,000 BTU light bar. Uh, they claim it has a, a Deutsch connector, which I'm familiar with. Uh, Deutsch has uh, been, uh, been around racing. And, Wire, wire harnesses in the racing industry for a long time, so that's some quality, quality stuff. And uh, so we're gonna find out if it's, uh, it's an invitation or if it's real stuff. And for the price, for what this might cost, it's pretty much a quarter of what the competitors' 40-inch light bars cost are. So, so let's, see, let's start with the wire harness. It does have a Deutsch connector. So that's good. Has a switch, has a relay. Everything's heat shrinked. It's got a fuse, inline fuse, so that's nice. Nice quality stuff. Doesn't look bad at all. Wire connections are all heat, heat shrunk. Switch looks nice. Looks like it has a little LED indicator. Let's take a look at the light, see what it's all about. Instruction sheet, warranty card. That's nice to have. Mount. Place the cast aluminum mount. Solid. Looks like it's got a quarter inch hole, which is nice. Wow, look at this beast. Powder coated. This film is a blue protective film. Per 40 inch light bar. To my door, it's like $430. So, uh, has a Deutsch connector. Oh, nice plug. They claim everything's uh, stainless. We've got a magnet here. We'll see. Uh, these all seem to be stainless. Oh, that's not stainless. That's sort of uh, probably some sort of nickel coated or, or some sort of uh, not quite stainless. But if that's the only issue we have, that stud could be swapped out. So $430 if this thing works. I don't mind it having that. Some steel parts on it, especially uh, see how this goes together here. So that looks like it's going to be nice. That's going to work out perfect. So stay tuned to Busted Knuckles Fishing. We're going to mount this thing on the roof of our boat and this thing should light up. It was plenty of light for our 27 foot game fish. So stay tuned. Our next video I'm going to mount it up and we're going to give it a try. See how it works. Thanks for watching.